There has been a handful of truly wild advancements in the robotics field. Lately these advancements don't involve the typical rigid robots made out of hard materials doing backflips or making pizzas. These advancements are a bit stranger, they are inspired by human flesh. Yes. Scientists are trying to create alternative of actuators and trying to create the robot that not only appear like human but also act like human. For this, researchers are trying to create artificial muscle for soft robotic. A lot of advancement were made to create real life muscle movement, but the most advanced and most fundamental approaches are taken by researchers of Hazel actuators. It's a kind of artificial muscle. All right. This advancement takes us to the University of Colorado Boulder where researchers are pushing the boundaries of soft robotics. Soft robotics is a subfield of robotics that is built on how living organisms move and interact with their environment and deal with compliant materials versus rigid materials. The researchers at Boulder developed a hydraulically amplified self-healing electrostatic actuator or Hazel actuator. For short, these actuators are made out of elastic pouches connected to electrodes and filled with vegetable oil. The oil is an electrically insulating liquid and when electricity is applied, the oil is displaced making the artificial muscle contract, and this can happen in milliseconds and changing the shape and configuration of pouches will produce different movements. Assistant Professor and Fellow of Material Science and Engineering Program Christoph Keplinger says Hazel actuators synergize the strength of soft fluidic and soft electrostatic actuators and thus combine versatility and performance like no other artificial muscle before. Just like biological muscles Hazel actuators can produce the adaptability of an octopus arm, the speed of a hummingbird and the strength of an elephant. End quote and one might be the most incredible part of this advancement is that the devices are made out of cost material and can be made for just 10 cents. The researchers are continuing to improve the technology. The actuators currently take a lot of power but they are working on devices that will operate on one-fifth of the power and they have secured patents for the technology and currently exploring commercial opportunities. Thanks for watching this video. For more such video you can subscribe our channel.